I'm Mrs. Owens. I'm Miss Marino. And this is Two Step Algebra with the distributive property in two minutes. Our equation is negative two times the quantity x plus three equals 10. So this is going to involve the distributive property. Remember, if there's a number right outside the parentheses, like this one, we multiply everything inside the parentheses by the outside number. We first multiply the negative two and the x. Remember to watch the signs. A negative times a positive makes a negative. So negative two times x equals negative two x. We also multiply the negative two by this positive three. And a negative times a positive makes a negative. So negative two times positive three equals negative six. Then we have negative two x minus six and we bring down the equal sign and the 10. Now we're back to a two step equation. So let's get rid of the lonely number first. That's the constant. To get rid of negative six, we add six. And to keep both sides in balance, we also add six to this side. We lose the six and are left with negative two x equals 10 plus six is 16. Now we want to get rid of the coefficient, so x stands alone. This negative two x really means negative two times x. And the opposite of multiplication is? Division. We divide by negative two on this side to cancel out negative two. And we also keep it in balance by dividing by negative two on this side. Negative two divided by negative two is one. So we get one x or just x. And on the other side, we have 16 divided by negative two. A positive divided by a negative makes a negative. So 16 divided by negative two equals negative eight. X equals negative eight. Negative two times the sum of negative eight and three equals 10. To solve it, we use the order of operations. PEMDAS, parentheses first. So negative eight plus three. Remember, different sign difference. Negative eight plus three equals negative five. Then we have negative two times negative five. And a negative times a negative equals a positive. So negative two times negative five equals 10. 10 equals 10, that checks out. Great, if we see parentheses in an equation, we do those first. And that gets us back to a two-step equation. First, we deal with the lonely number, the constant. Be sure to keep both sides in balance. Second, deal with the coefficient, to get x by itself, and keep both sides in balance. And there you have it, two-step equations with the distributive property in two minutes.